All right, the theme for today, or the theme for the discussion is from script to screen and everything in between. So pretty much talking about everything that has to um, do with Nollywood. My first question is, um, whose role is most crucial in the process of filmmaking? I don't know that I can I can say there's there's one particular thing that could be classified as most crucial. Uh, it's kind of like cooking food. Um, however, the beginning uh, of every great film work would be the script, and so the power that um, that the screenwriter has in in giving us great story, great script, great characters, great dialogue, you know, cannot be overemphasized, and that's. That's essentially the beginning of every great movie. How can movie themes better impact the society? I think it's in different ways. So right now there is a concentration on comedy. And you can say people can easily realize that and say, hey, they just want to laugh. But to be honest, you're in a country where there's a lot of negative stuff going on. And helping people laugh is actually a fantastic thing because otherwise they would probably be killing themselves. So that's a service. That's something that's good. What role is social media currently playing in the industry and how much more can it do? It's playing a huge role. I mean, let's see how many years before now, there was no social media. So you can imagine. So now, like she said, it's cheaper way. You just post, get your actors to post, get their friends to repost, your neighbors to post. Everybody has seen it. Then by the time they go and see the movie, and definitely can do more than just beauty shots. That's my own <laughs> finish. <laughs> So yeah, social media can actually do more than um, it's actually doing for the film industry um, right now. But um, in a way, it's better um, to get something done that's different if it's positive. Um, I realize that social media nowadays, people would rather sell with negative headlines and negative news than positive Nobody wants to put out something that's positive or even write about it because they feel they'll get less clicks or you know less people reading. So um, that's what I would plead with the social media to, to work on more. Positive reviews from movies, from actors, from filmmakers or whatever. The next question is, what are the challenges with production and distribution in a global world? Raising money to make films in Nigeria is, 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 <laughs> in fact, it's gotten better now. And that's where this new Nollywood, as you say, has come about. It's gotten better now because there are films that have now, uh, the cinema, people are seeing where their money can come from, right? But still, unfortunately, as we speak, we only have 28 cinemas. It's supposed to be 30 something cinemas, but only 28 of them have a digital format that can play like an encrypted video. So technically, we only have 28 cinemas, right? And um, for a country of 200 million people, how do we make these films? Um, what channel can we use to monetize our films where these millions, are, which is the, 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 the main benefit of Nigeria population, right? That's why FMCG, all these companies are making so much money in Nigeria. We have a large population. How do we tap that population not right now? Is it going to be through mobile downloads? Is it going to be through the internet? What is going to, how do we do that? Because the cinemas can't grow fast enough. The cinemas cost a lot of money to build and to operate and to maintain, so nobody's going to roll out that many cinemas as quickly. So can technology help us? Maybe that's the next step, and that's what everybody's trying to crack now. And this thing about Telemundo, I hate it. <laughs> Telemundo is affecting Nigerian movies. People watch Nigerian movies back then like crazy. They'll be on Africa Magic nonstop. Nowadays, it's Telemundo. If you go to hotels, all they have on, yeah, they are always tuning into Telemundo. We need to stop this Telemundo thing. It is bad. Telemundo is affecting Nigerian film industry like crazy. It is. You know, it's very, very wrong. Because back then, it was only Africa magic that people would watch. You enter hotels, you go into anywhere, all you see on the TV is Africa magic. And you're happy that people are watching home videos. But now, it's Telemundo or Z World. What new career opportunities are there in the, in the new Nollywood? What is the potential for making money in this industry? Plenty potential now. <laughs> well, for me, I'll speak from my perspective. When I first started in the industry, it wasn't about making money. I was very inquisitive. I was passionate about it. But you see, 
See a man diligence. If you are doing your work conscientiously, doing it well, you are you 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 find a niche for yourself. You are known for a certain level of professionalism and all that. Before you know it, brands will attach themselves to you. The most important opportunity is investors. <laughs> we need investors. There's a huge opening for you guys. <laughs> because without investors, without sponsors, there's no Nollywood movie. There's no good Nollywood movie to come out. Um, so we need people to believe in us, to take a chance and invest, give us the opportunity to make you proud. All right, um, we have come to the end of this discussion. Thank you guys for listening.